so in my role as CMO, definitely uh, this is a, it, this role as an agent for change in the organisation. I, I think it's the, the 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 role that needs to challenge the board. I think it is the role that needs to be the voice of the customer. Um, I think it's the role that should never be happy, should never be settled, always innovating. I think marketing is not the responsibility of the marketing department. Marketing is everybody's responsibility, and that kind of sounds like a trite statement, but it's absolutely the case. Everything that we do, the way we send our invoices, the way our accounts department deals with external suppliers, is, says something about our brand, or something about our organisation. So marketing, as well as its focus on the customer and innovation, has to understand what its brand really stands for and has to be the, the guardian for the brand. I definitely think marketing used to be much more cost focused and more focused on the creative and the brand and those traditional elements and yes driving the strategy but but now the return on investment the P&L accountability I think is for for all the positive reasons is much much higher on the marketing agenda so I think people are less looking at marketing as doing some of those just those brand things but it's right at the heart of of adding value it's looked to as a bit of the business that can help uh, drive change and that has definitely moved on over the years and I think the marketing as it used to be um, was was much less about P&L and much less about financial you know, it was it was the joke you know it, marketing lovely all creative and fluffy over here but actually to be successful now we absolutely have to be have the, the same objectives as the sales guys and, and, and as our trading teams and really really be sharp on, on, on the numbers all the time.